Congratulations on La La Land. Um, the dancing is phenomenal. I was just wondering, like, is it really painful? Was the training process really painful? It was really, really fun. Yeah. We had three months, so that was actually an amazing amount of time to to start learning to tap dance like a child <laughs> like in a child. tap class. <laughs> so we did, you know, all of our little exercises and then eventually got to actually learn choreography. I definitely beat up my feet a bit, but it was... Um, it was worth it. Obviously, La La Land is such kind of a reflection of the French and American kind of golden age of cinema. How do you think Hollywood's changed since those times? Oh, I don't know, because I wasn't around for those, even though I would have loved to have been. I think, you know, it's nice that there's not really a studio system that you're stuck in anymore, which is which can be good. Um, but I, I don't know, I loved the kind of, you know, technicolor, anamorphic, like the way that this was filmed was so was so much fun to see and that's that's increasingly rare to shoot on film and and um have these kinds of you know obviously dance numbers and back lots and um so it was really fun to kind of pay homage to that that era i can imagine you get asked about ryan gosling every day what's kind of one thing that we might not know about him a good thing he loves twizzlers twizzlers oh yeah wow he used to eat so many Twizzlers on set, it was concerning. It was like he had it in his suit pocket, just another Twizzler, another Twizzler, another, he really loves Twizzlers. You should bring him some Twizzlers if you want to get on his good side. No take. Yep. Two options. You either follow my rules or follow my rules. Capiche? Thank you. I can do it a different way. Mia obviously faces a lot of setbacks in the film. Was it fun to play those things or was it quite hard because you've kind of said that you've faced, you know, audition rejections and, well, how was that to film? I mean, it was nice. It was a very cathartic experience. Those, you know, in years of auditioning and 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 feeling the things that that Mia is feeling, it's nice to actually have it turn into something productive at the end of the day. I think any actor can relate to um to those feelings, but it's um you just got to keep keep trucking. You said it's a film for dreamers, so I was just wondering what's on your bucket list to do. Oh God, I I I really n need to learn to cook. Okay. <laughs> I need to get better at cooking. Yeah. And just That's a bucket list situation. <laughs> and just finally, you mentioned that you, there was a lot of improvisation in the film. I was just wondering if you could just quickly improvise a little dance move with your hands. Dance. Perfect. Did you like it? Yeah. Okay, thanks.